Welcome to the BetQL Daily Boost. I'm Lucy Burge of BetQL.com, and I am joined by Rick Chapsky and Kate Constable, and we have an NBA odds boost for all of you today on Kevin Durant and Devin Booker to each have over 24 and a half points. This is boosted to plus 350 at Caesars. So Durant had 23 in his son's debut, and it should only be up from there, I think, and Booker just scored 37 points. So there is great value in this odds boost. Yeah, you've got to imagine that Kevin Durant's only going to get more comfortable in the Suns' offense. And in his first game against Charlotte, I mean, you said it, he had over 23 points. and He looked very comfortable already, so there isn't going to be a whole lot of, like, onboarding time for him. And that makes all the other players around him better. So, Devin Booker, to have 37 when Kevin Durant is also scoring in the mid-20, mid to low 20s, like, that's really impressive. I think those two are just going to continue to thrive off each other. So you can expect big games from both of them every night, which is crazy and a little scary for the rest of the teams. Watch out Western Conference, but more yeah. comfortable. Durant took 15 shots in the first day game right. he was with the team. I don't know how much more comfortable he can get. Uh, 41 of the 89 shots the other night came from either Booker or Durant. 46%. And that was game number one for Durant. I was expecting 20 minutes. He got about 26 so that was way more than I expected. So yeah, he fit in right away. So it should be interesting to see what Durant does and everyone's saying, hey, I like Phoenix in the West. I like Phoenix in the West. You know who I don't like? The Clippers. Ooh, <laughs> Everyone has yes. been yep. saying the Clippers all season long, but man, has yep. that been a disaster, but fun to watch. But anyway, this is about the boost in Durant and Booker, which I like. Yes, that is the, well, you know, we can continue the conversation anytime, but but uh, get in on this odds boost at, uh, at, at Caesars and keep an eye on the Suns and head to betql.com to get your free three day trial today and check out our exclusive sports book offers there as well. And follow us on Twitter at RickCZ1, at Kate Constable, and at Lucille Burge, our favorite bets for today. This is a big spread, but I'm going with the Celtics minus 11 against the Nets. The Nets are kind of a dumpster fire. They are not that good right now. So I am pretty comfortable taking Celtics minus 11. The Nets just got annihilated by the Knicks in that 142 to 118 loss. The Celtics have covered the spread in the last six meetings with the Nets. Not to mention, they have also won the last 10 matchups against them, and they only failed to cover in two of those. The Celtics are also 34 and 29 against the spread eight this season, 18 and 14 against the spread as the favorite. So I like the Celtics to get it done here and cover this huge spread tonight. I love that, Lucy, and I'm just going to piggyback right off of that and take the Celtics team total over. Why not? I mean, if we're expecting a big game from them and covering an 11-point spread, it's likely going to be a blowout, which means the Celtics are going to be scoring quite a bit. So this number is at 119.5 right now. I think it's only going to go up as the day goes on, so I would grab this now. Celtics are averaging 119 points in their last 10 home games, but the Brooklyn Nets giving up 134 points on the road since Kyrie Irving requested a trade. That is absolutely atrocious. Like that's not even an NBA basketball team right there. What's going on? And the Celtics have also gone over their team total in seven of their last 10 home games, their last three straight home games. So a three and zero sample size over those last games. So I just feel like this is, I hate the word lock and I'll never use it in sports betting because there's no such thing as a lock. But this is like, you know, I've typed in the code it, no one's getting in the keypad type of thing. I, I'm pretty confident in this one. Love that one. I'm also going to take the... No, I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm taking the Celtics. Yeah, no. exactly. Yeah. First quarter assist by bench players over to... No, I am going to go college basketball. You know me. I uh, had a nice victory last time we chatted. And I'm going to head to the MVC, the Missouri Valley here for some SIU Missouri State battle here. And I'm gonna go SIU, the number three seed coming into the Missouri Valley. They're a very interesting team. They don't shoot many three pointers, which is rare in college basketball and just basketball in general right now, but they do it down low in the paint. One of the best two point percentages in all of college basketball. And then they defend the two really well. So they slow down games. They play a different style of basketball. And they've beaten Missouri State both times they played them. 
uh, this season. They beat them on the road, which is very important, and then beat them by 20 at home. So I expect a pretty easy victory for uh, SIU here today. And trivia time, Lucy, your yes. favorite yes. mascot of SIU. I know Kate knows this one. She's No, Kate, Ooh. you don't? SIU. Yeah, I know this one. I know this one. Okay. Is it a, a kind of bird? No, it's a kind of dog. Oh, is it a bulldog? Nope. Is it a terrier? It's a it's a very rare yeah. uh, probably a <laughs> poodle. Uh... <laughs> it is a, a saluki. Oh, really? Are, I never in one Southern million years, Illinois. Rick, would have no. gotten that. Never, Southern. ever. <laughs> it's a good thing a... you didn't let me keep going until I got it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and we would have been out here a long time. <laughs> It would have been Westminster here. It would have been the, the weekly boost because it would have been a whole <laughs> of me just being like, is it a Chihuahua? Is it a great nope. day? Wow. Take the well, two and a half. There you go. I will never forget that now as long yeah. as I live. So thank you, Rick, for that. And get in on all of these bets and the odds boost and subscribe to the BetQL Daily Boost wherever you get your podcast.